Greetings and salutations. Okay, uh, so yesterday from 1989, we had Lean On Me. Today, it is 1989's Heathers. Very different film. Uh, so this one is about uh, Veronica, uh, played by Winona Ryder. Uh, she's a part of a, sort of a group, a group of mean girls, you could say. Uh, the other three mean girls, they're all named Heathers. Are you a Heather? Um, and then this new kid, uh, JD, shows up at school and he sort of uh, disturbs the natural order of things. Uh, so this one's different because this one uh, very much is satire. Uh, this one uh, deals with things like teen suicide and groupthink and sort of uh, repressed personalities and peer pressure and all that sort of fun stuff uh, that's ripe for uh, some satire. Uh, so we got kids. Didn't have kids yesterday. We got kids today. Who are our kids? Are they actually played by kids? Uh, so Winona Ryder, she is Veronica Sawyer. Uh, she was about 18 years old in 1989. Yeah, she's a kid. Uh, and then we have Jason Dean, J.D., uh, Christian Slater uh, doing his Jack Nicholson. He's always kind of doing Jack Nicholson, isn't he? Um, he's about 20 years old in 1989. Uh, and then we have Heather Duke, one of the Heathers. Uh, Shannon Doherty, she's around 18 years old as well. Uh, Heather McNamara. Uh, Lizanne Falk, she's the oldest of the bunch here. She's about 25 years old. And then finally, Heather Chandler, uh, Kim Walker. She's about 21 years old. Um, I don't know if it's just me, but Christian Slater of all of them looks the most baby-faced. Um, anyways, so uh, we're talking about a school movie. We're talking about kids, high school. Is there music? Uh, yes, there is. Um, uh, the film starts and ends with different versions of K Sera Sera. So that's the number one with a bullet that obviously all the kids are listening to in 89, right? That was just a little girl. Anyways, uh, there's also a fictional song in here uh, because this is a satire. Uh, Teenage Suicide, Don't Do It. Fictional band, Big Fun. Everybody's got the Big Fun t-shirts. Uh, I believe it's supposed to be a riff on a Queen song. Uh, so this film... What's it remembered for? Well, when it came out, it was a flop. Uh, I think it had like a $3 million budget and only made a million dollars. Um, and sort of some of the subject matters uh, in the film probably rubbed people the wrong way. White probably didn't understand it. Um, but it has become a cult classic. They tried to revive it as a TV show, but in the climate... <sighs> with school shootings, that makes it tough. Uh, anyways, thank you for watching. Like and subscribe. 